It's funny how life can be so short and unpredictable. It took me a long time to actually believe that Liam Payne had actually passed away. Because the day he died, I watched his Snapchat stories of their trip in Argentina, having breakfast and so full of life. A lovely day here in Argentina. This is the breakfast table. Just enjoying coffee and breakfast, even though it's like 1 p.m. And then in the next few hours, I hear the news. Liam is gone. Yesterday, a private funeral was held at Mary's church in his hometown, bringing together his loved ones to honor his memory. It lasted around 30 to 45 minutes. I want to thank his family for organizing a really beautiful funeral for him. His blue coffin was brought in a white carriage, ridden by two white horses, which was adorned with roses. Red roses spelling out son and white roses spelling out daddy. Among the few people who attended his funeral were his former bandmates from the One Direction. Simon Cowell, who put the One Direction band together on X Factor. TV reporter James Coden. Liam Payne's girlfriend, Kate Cassidy his ex-girlfriend, Cheryl, and his parents, of course. Since the funeral was private, it didn't stop fans from around the world from saying their goodbyes. They shared memories, photos, and heartfelt messages celebrating Liam's talent and legacy. May his soul rest in peace.